guys welcome back to another video today's video is going to be a bath and body works haul you guys i have went like two different times and i'm kind of embarrassed about the baggage that i have right now because i have a really big bag and i have it sitting right next to me because it's too big and heavy to hold on to because i have it filled with candles and then i went back again and i got another bag this bag i can show you i can look this one and they have these cute little totes you guys that you guys can pick up i think this one was like three dollars um so i'm trying to think do i want to do that first or the candles um let's just go with this bag right here let's do this one first we have a lot of goodies in here um, let me see if I can twist this bag around real quick and maybe without dropping my stuff. That way I can have that sitting there too. Okay, so they had, um, this is my annual sale going on here. I think it's still going on. I think so. I think it started like on the third or something, but they had these really cool, like 1970s designs, 60 designs, something like that. And I just really love the designs. So I had to go pick these up. So I have golden sunflower in the lotion and in the spray stuff smells so good you guys um can't see once again without my glasses all the little notes that's in there about the scents and stuff but obviously you guys can find it um this stuff smells amazing you guys i love how it smells oh my i, I swear i smell like a hint just like a small hint of coconut it smells like coconut and i also feel like i smell vanilla in there but i'm not sure but this smells like summer you guys if you haven't smelled this yet i suggest you guys go pick it up they had this one that i wanted to get i think it was called cotton candy in the clouds and i had that in my cart and i was like i better go up there to smell it just to see if i'm really gonna like it because i don't want to keep returning stuff and so i went to go smell that one it was very light couldn't even hardly smell it it wasn't sweet it almost reminded me of like pink sugar i think it is I think that's the body spray I'm thinking about from another company, but almost reminds me of that, but it's very light and you really can't smell it to be honest. So then I went back and well, I didn't go back. I got all the stuff in one spot here. Um, the big bag is what I went back for and got at a different time. But um, then I have two more of like the old fashioned type things. And this is called rainbow waves. And I just got the body lotion in that. They did not have the body sprays in these, so we just got the lotions. I think they had the cream, what is it, like the 24-hour moisture cream that's like in a shower tube. But I got these two, you guys, and they're just so pretty. Look, they had like four of these different designs, and I can't think of what the other two scents were called from that line, but I didn't like them as much as that one. And then I picked up a couple things for Hubby. Because these were like $3.95 and then plus I had a coupon off. So they came down to like $3.75 for me. Um, this is Rosewood and Smoke. And I got him the body lotion. This is the one I was trying to tell you that they had. And what is that one? Rainbow Wave. They had it in the body cream like this. So I got him this and I got the body spray. You guys, if you don't know, they do have certain scents for men and body sprays, which is really cool. Because I don't think they used to have this before. I know they had the lotions like the deodorant spray and then the colognes, but now they have the body sprays, you guys, and they only have them in certain scents. This one smells really good. Um, what else did we get? We got a couple of the new scents. Um, where's the other one? It's going to show you guys the body spray if I can find it. I don't know where my lid went to this one, but it's called Love Always Wins, and here's the body lotion. It's so pretty, you guys. I love the design on there. The colors are so simple and subtle very pretty and then I also got the body spray right here this one I can't really describe but I feel like it's different from any of their other scents that they've had I can smell like a little fruity but I don't know fruity but sophisticated if that makes sense that's just what I'm getting from it you know the top I'm kind of weird when I describe scents but that's what I'm getting from it fruity the sophisticated so then because i got that little spray i had to pick up two more um these are new ones too and this is called firecracker pop you guys if you guys have ever had like when you were a kid those little um popsicles that are like red white and blue oh my goodness when i smell this it's gonna sound weird but when i smell this i automatically go back to my childhood and think of that it smells so good and fruity it smells just like candy you guys if you guys haven't picked this up or you haven't been to smell it, you guys really need to go. I highly suggest picking up this one if you're only going to get one thing from what I've picked up. I love this one. It smells so good. I'm actually going to put a little bit of it on because I'm crazy about it, you guys. It smells so good. I wish they had Smell-O-Vision where you guys you could just smell this through the TV. It smells so good. 
Oh my gosh. I'm like really smelling like, like cherry and blueberry. It's just makes me want to go get an ice ball. No joke. I'm not even joking with you guys. That's how good that smells. And then I have one more body spray from this bag. And this is Endless Sea. They had two of them. I can't remember what the other new one was, but it was in red. This one smells really good. I feel like this is different from any other scents that they've had from their new lines or any line. This is really good, you guys. Um, It just smells so good. This one almost smells like a fancy perfume, you guys. Like not a body spray from Bath & Body Works, but like a very good expensive perfume from a high-end store. It smells amazingly good uh let's see what else do we have we only have some of the wallflower plugins and i have a few of those and i picked up these scents i don't think i've ever seen these scents at bath stores before the bath and body Works store but they had midnight path when i first started using stuff from bath and body works probably like 22 years ago um, I used to love this lotion, you guys, and now they have it in the wall plugins and I seen this and yes, they were on sale, you guys. So I got three of them. I don't like to overdo it with, cause like I get bored with scents very easy. I swear I felt a hair right here. I was like right there and I have a fly in here too. So if you guys see something flying around, but I love these so much and I got three of them and these are going to be for my bedroom, I think, because they are my favorite scents. And then... On top of everything else, I have, like, really been digging lemon, you guys. Lemon has been the thing. Lemon and uh, lavender, I've really been digging it in the wall plugins. So, I got Laundry Room Lemon. And then I got, what is this one? Kitchen Lemon. And I think that says Honolulu Sun, I think. I can't see without my glasses. <laughs> but I got two of those ones because, like I said, I'm digging the lemon. And then the other one that I got here is Vanilla and Santel. I hope I'm pronouncing that, that right. I'm always mispronouncing everything. Also, you guys, ever look my nails. I need to do them. I was going to do them yesterday. I don't want to go and have them done because I just felt last time we made them so brittle. So we're just going to paint them and go old school. Okay, next we are moving into this big bag. And I do have another one. And the thing fell off of this one. But I do believe it's Endless Weekend because I remember when I picked these up, I got two. And the other one is already plugged in. Let me put that one down there. So these are, I have like three more body products. And then you guys, the rest is candles. So this is Amethyst Waves. And this one smells really nice too. Again, I smell like a hint of coconut. And I don't know, just a bunch of other goodness. But it smells amazing. My daughter says she sent this one time. She sent it this. She smelt this one time at the store. And she said, Mom, I just didn't like it at that time. And she used a little bit of it the other day when she was up here. And she's like, I should have got that. That smelled really good. You know, sometimes you smell stuff and you're like, no way. I don't want that. I would never wear that. I don't like it. And then you go back again and you're like, wow, that smells good. And then you end up getting it. At least I do. So the next two is a matching set. And these are... Saltwater Breeze, and I have the body lotion, and I have the body spray. This smells really good. This is like a nice, clean, fresh smell, like, like out of the shower, almost like fresh laundry. I know that sounds weird, but that's what it reminds me of. It just smells so, so good. Close up. Very good smell. Um, Let's see. Okay, so the rest of this is candles. The rest of it's candles. Let me get my receipts out of here. Um, I got multiples of certain ones because I think they were like limited edition. I don't know if they're going to keep them around. And I love the packaging and I love the smell. And the weird thing about these candles is, is that they have flannel in the fall time. And I'm always bypassing that. I never cared for that scent before. However, the packaging drawed me in. And then I went back for more. It's so pretty. Look at how beautiful and elegant this packing chin is, which goes perfect in my dining room because my dining room, we just redid it. We painted the entire thing like snow white. When I say snow white, like it is white, you guys, like probably whiter than this. And my curtains are white and black. So this goes perfect in my dining room and it smells, it just smells amazing. It smells so good. And I think, I don't think I need to show you guys this. I got, well, 
Okay, we're just gonna pull these out and put this one back down in there. I got one, another one. We got another one of the flannel. And then another one of the flannel. So I think that makes like three of the flannels that I got because you just can't have enough flannel. And then I got this one and I think this is part of the collection too for like the limited edition one. Um, this one is called Spice Cardigan, Cardamon. I don't know. I'm not pronouncing that correctly. I know that. But this is what she looks like. Very sleek packaging. I wish that they would make these like forever. Not just like limited edition because they smell so good and they're so pretty. But it just smells so good. It makes me think of fall time, but also air conditioning room in the summer. I know that makes no sense whatsoever, but it's true. And then I got another one. I got this. It's Paris Cafe. And this one is for my husband. He absolutely loves the coffee candles. So I got him this one. And when you burn this one, I feel like this one and the flannel one gives the most throw in the room. Like you can really smell it. It just smells so good. It makes it actually makes me want to go get coffee like right now. Um, the next one that I got here, and these are dusty because I've had these for probably three weeks. And I just haven't gotten around to doing this haul. And I was like, today, I have free time. I need to get done and get it up. But this is springtime in Paris. And I love the packaging on this one. I think this is like a mint green is what you would say. Like, it's just so pretty. And it smells so good. The candle is white itself. But it has a nice perfume smell to it. It reminds me of some scent that I used to have when I was a kid. And I can't think of what it was. It was like an air freshener in the bathroom. But it smells so good, you guys. And this takes me back to my childhood. I know that's weird because it does smell like perfume. But that's what I'm getting from this one. Um, I have like three more candles that I forgot to put in the bag. Let me go run and grab those and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So we are back. And I just realized that I did not turn on my other light. So see, if I would have went like this, it would have been probably much prettier. But we're going to turn it back off because that's how we started the video. <laughs> that's how we're going to leave the video. But this one is Turquoise Waters. And this is a favorite of mine too. And it just smells so clean and fresh. And I like to put this one like maybe in the bathroom or in my living room. I just like those kind of scents there that's more subtle. It's more florally. Just... I love those scents in this room. And then I got another one. This is for my kitchen. And this is, I'm being my chair over here, my vanity. Um, this is rose water and uh, vanilla bean. And I love this because it looks like little confetti, like little sprinkles off of a cake. So this one is definitely going to go into my kitchen. And the candle itself is white. And I can only smell the rose just a little bit. The whole thing smells like really, really sweet. Not like you're smelling floral too much. There's a hint of it, but it's mostly sweet scent that I smell. I don't even smell vanilla. I don't know why, how they got that in there, but it does not smell like vanilla. And then this one is pink lavender and espresso. And this one smells really good. This one is going to go in my dining room, probably after the flannel ones have burned out. Because I want to use those first. I'm digging it for the summer. It's just a really good scent. And then again, the candle is white. I, this one is a lot lighter and I don't smell lavender. I can smell a little bit of espresso and maybe a hint of vanilla, but this one is way lighter than the, the um, cafe one that I got. It smells like coffee. And then I got another one of this. I actually put one up in my room that I'm already burning. This makes my third one. This is one of my favorite scents for my bedroom because when I'm in here, I just want to chill out, relax, and just endure the quietness. So this one is Driftwood Wave. And when you're burning this, it, look at the beautiful packaging. It's gorgeous. So when you burn this one, it actually puts out like a baby powder scent. Not in the old fashioned like 70 year old woman. Not that anything's wrong with that. But a nice, fresh, clean baby powder scent. It smells amazing. It just relaxes you when you smell it. And it really does throw throughout my whole bedroom. I highly suggest this one. This one's a little more expensive. I think this one was $32.95. But I got all these on sale, you guys. I would never pay that much for this. Maybe I would. <laughs> but this one smells really good. Check this one out if you guys haven't checked it out yet when you go. It's a really good one. Okay, you guys. We have come to an end. I know it seemed like it went by kind of fast, but I'm just always hyper and fast. I have like coffee this morning and whatnot. <laughs> so I'm just like out there today. But 
let's talk about this necklace real quick while we're over here. I got this at TJ Maxx. Good find. And I was just reading that this had, um, what was it? It was like jewel glass or something. I'll have to link it down below if I can actually find the company that made it. But look at how beautiful she is. $19.99 at TJ. And I need to do a haul because I have a lot of good stuff that I found over there that I need to post too. But that's the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed it, found anything useful, or you just want to hang out and be friends, just go ahead and hit that subscribe button and like, comment. Let's be friends, you guys. Um, also, if you're not following me on Instagram, head over there. It is beauty underscore by underscore A to R and check things out. And yeah, until next time, you guys, I'll see you later. Bye.